Now I did notice uh, after the last video that uh, you will get a couple errors on the bottom down here. So if I play this, you'll see that you're going to have uh, some errors about your work coordinate system. So it says work offset table entry not found, and it shows that there's two errors. What this is caused from is our G-code offsets here. So you'll see under our program 0 we have subsystem 1, registry 1, from tool to um, program 0. So we're going to go from our tool to our program 0. That is correct. We're just trying to use registry 1. And because our program is programmed with G54, that causes a problem. So we need to go in and edit it. And just changing it from this program 0 it doesn't quite work here. Um, so coordinate system, we're using program 0. But for the G code offsets, if we click on program 0, we want to change it from program 0 to work offsets. Now at this point, it's easier actually to do this by double clicking it. Alright, so here, instead of being offset named program 0, I change this to work offsets. And you'll see that auto changes it up here. And then I make it registry 54. And I go from spindle to stock, but actually I want to go from tool to stock. No, I want to go to a system program zero. So what you want to do is click on the work offsets, change it from, um, well actually I'll click on program offsets, change it to work offsets, make it registry 54, then down here this will all kind of auto update and it's wrong so you want to change it component origin from tool to CSYS origin to program zero. Now if I reset it and play it, I get everything done and I don't have any errors down here. Now it really doesn't matter, it would have worked fine, but I just wanted to show you how to get rid of those errors so it actually uses the G54.